Are you serious? Are you serious? Folks, BP Earthwatch has a video out. He just put it out. Four storms in the Atlantic. Full update. Lining up for the eclipse. Now, your mainstream uh, media has not covered this yet. BP Earthwatch is way out ahead of this. But here we go. First of all, you need to know this is Hurricane Gert. It has now become a hurricane. There you see the East Coast. There's the Florida. Right in there is there is Hurricane Gert. It is now a Category 1 hurricane. But look what's forming behind it. One, two, and another storm right back here. It's off the radar. Plus, you have this low pressure system in front. Now, it was up here. It has moved into the front right here in front of this tropical storm. And, in, and of course, this one's right behind it. Now, this low pressure system, if it, it gets right in here and holds, this one's going to run into it. It's going to, then it will reorganize. Then you have this one. If it hits it, it reorganizes, and then here's the real question: What does Gert do? Does Gert just hang around? Does Gert shoot off into the Atlantic, or does Gert inch toward the coast, or does it sit there and wait on this? And this is what's going to blow your mind. I'm pointing at South Carolina, right there, South Carolina, South Carolina. By the time these storms get to South Carolina, if they were to go in that direction, and we don't know if they'll go this way or if they'll cut across Florida or will they go across the islands and work their way up in the Gulf, we don't know what these three other storms are going to do, and we don't know what Gert's going to do. But I can tell you this, that between now and the total solar eclipse, they could all meet right here. These storms behind us, one of them out of the three, you got one here, one here, one here. You got three storms and a low pressure uh, in front of it. <clears throat> Folks, on the day of the solar eclipse, August 21st, when the solar eclipse comes across the country and it makes its way right here to South Carolina, we may have an intersection. We may have a collision. We may absolutely have a collision of unprecedented biblical proportions, and that is South Carolina may be under a total solar eclipse and a massive hurricane at the same time. Are you serious? Because that's what they're projecting. These storms that are coming up off the coast of Africa, that's when they're projecting they should meet or they should reach uh, the coast, if they come in this direction, if they flow this way, one of these three is going to go in here if they go this way. Now, they might all three shoot underneath here and go like this. Or they may come in here and shoot like this. Or they may come over here and cut across Florida. Or they might just come right up here and get behind Gert and just go on out to the Atlantic and not, not touch the United States. But I'll tell you what, now that you got Gert and three more, that's four storms in the Atlantic at once. This is dangerous, folks. And, it, and it, it's, it's on a collision course with the solar eclipse. What? So are you serious? Something biblical is going on here with the signs of the second coming of Christ. There shall be signs in the sun. Well, that's an eclipse. And in the moon. All right. Well, that's an eclipse. And in the stars. Well, that's the constellations that's coming up. And distress of nations. We got that going on. And the, with perplexity or confusion. And the sea and the waves roaring. So let's read it again. This is Luke 21, 25. For there shall be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars. And distress of nations with perplexity. The sea and the waves roaring. Men's hearts will fail them for fear. For looking after those things that are coming upon the earth. Then shall we see the Son of Man coming in a cloud with power and great glory. When these things begin to come to pass, he said, look up, lift up your head, for your redemption is drawing nigh. Are you saved? Don't miss today's live broadcast. Starts at 12 noon Eastern. We'll talk about this and a whole lot more.
Don't be late. 12 noon Eastern at my website at paulbegleyprophecy.com.